While certain development projects in Jacksonville's downtown area have been put on hold, others are in full swing. We asked residents who spend a lot of time downtown their thoughts on the area's future development. Uh, more businesses where there's so many vacancies, you know, because there's a lot of rundown buildings or a lot of empty spaces that need something there. I hope some of the facilities bring more business people here, actually create some economy so they can spend more funding on these situations. Um, I see a few of these older buildings and unfortunately the longer they sit here, the more money it takes to develop them. Quite frankly, it needs basically a little more attractions, less buildings and more attractions, mostly. More parks, more places to sit back and relax. Seven Plaza is the only place you can really sit back and read a book. The more businesses you have, the more people it brings. So you know, ultimately, you'll have the economy here. It's a great city. But there's no denying a number of problems that deter some residents from spending more time in the downtown area. They need more stores, too, down here, so you can buy, you know, just necessities. It's a very nice area, but they're just, the homeless need, need more. They need, they need some more things taking place. Um, the homeless people need a place that they can build their lives again. All the construction and noises at night. Because, I mean, the apartments I, used to, I live in right now, there's construction going on. You can hear it all night. That's cleaning up crews, early morning banging around. It gets kind of old real quick. For more on the status of construction and development in downtown Jacksonville, check out the first business section of Monday's Florida Times Union or anytime on Jacksonville.com. For Jacksonville.com, I'm Amanda Warford.